Okay, did you get your left hand ready? Because now we're going to do those last five notes of line two. And this time we're going up from the five. Five, four, three, two. And we're going to hold that cat for four because it's a whole note, right? Five, four, three, two, and one. This is exactly the same ending as we had for seagulls. So this video is not new either. Okay, what will be new is trying to put the two hands into the one line. But we'll worry about that when we get there. For now, <laughs> we're just going to do these five notes in the left hand. I'll see you at the piano. Okay, so the ending for At the Circus is with the left hand. And it's exactly the same five notes that we had for seagulls. So it should be super duper easy. But I'll show you anyway. We're going to do five, four, angry ant, bumblebee, cat. Two, three, four. Again. Five, four, angry ant, bumblebee, cat. Two, three, four. Five, four, angry ant, bumblebee, cat. Two, three, four. Five, four. Angry ant, bumblebee, cat. Two, three, four. Let's do the finger numbers. Five, four, three, two, and hold. Two, three, four. Five, four, three, two, and hold. Two, three, four. Five, four, three, two, and hold. Two, three, four. Have fun. Okay, so how did you go with those five notes this time? Are they getting easier? Are you finding the five and the four in the left hand are getting stronger as we go through the book? They're getting better? They should be because we're playing them lots and lots and lots. And I promised you, the more you use them, the stronger they get, the easier it gets, right? So keep using them. Make sure you keep using them. Anyway, in the next video, we're going to look at putting that whole line two together from beginning to end. So get your two hands ready. We're going to need both and we'll see how we go.